Hey guys, Dave here from Iographer. Wanted to show you a quick demo on how fast it is to go live to Facebook or to uh, YouTube using Switcher Go. So I'm gonna type in there, Switcher Go. We're gonna launch the app. It's got three things here. We can go to Facebook Live, we can go to YouTube Live, or we can just record it to the disk and I'll show you why all three are great. First, we're gonna go out to Facebook Live. I'm gonna click on there and uh, it should pop up momentarily. There it is, it's logging into Facebook. And we're gonna go in here and we're gonna type in. Okay, we are logged into Facebook. We are going to go, I can go to my timeline. I can do that, I can click on the timeline, but I can go to a page or a group or an event. I'm just gonna to go to a Facebook page. And we're gonna click okay. And now I'm gonna select the page and I'm gonna choose iographer. And we're gonna go there and we're gonna go uh, demo of switcher go. Okay, so now I have the options of going low quality, medium, high, or HD. This all depends on uh, my connection I have in my Wi Fi or LTE. For this sake of this, I'm gonna just keep it in high. Probably could push it to HD, but I'm gonna keep it to high for now. And then we're just gonna go create live stream. And uh, if you go onto our facebook.com slash iographer page, you'll probably see an archive of this. Um, I'm actually gonna pull that up right now. And uh, we're gonna flip the camera back this way to me. Hello, everybody. And I'm gonna go into, um, I'm gonna pull up my iographer page so we can kind of, um, kind of have it both ways there and see what's going on. And I love this program, and I'll show you why in a second. That's just such a great app to have on my phone to really get the news out there. Now, one caveat is that you're not going to be able to uh, to comment to people. So it's really if you have some news you want to get out there live right away, um, you can get out there, and 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 I'll show you how powerful it is. But you're not going to be able to interact. Something that they have coming later, and um, so we'll see. So I, I'm not live yet, but let me just show you. If I press the red button, I can go live. I can mute my audio. Here's my audio meters up on top. Uh, next to the audio meters is my archive of things I have shot. The little star down here is where it starts to get really interesting. If I click on that, now I've got options to bring in content. And so I can bring in a lower third, which is right there. And let's bring that down. You can see the lower third on the right side. I can bring in a uh, web page I desire. I can bring in video. And let me just show you this plus on the right side is where you bring it all in. So I can go into my um, library, photos, videos, any albums I have. Go into Switcher Go camera. Um, I can bring in, uh, broadcast will begin shortly, all these pre-made things. There's test um, patterns, chart images, app icon, etc. All these things are available. And I can use them as either an overlay, which I did with this, um, with this uh, lower third on the right here. Use it as an overlay. And if I want to change it, I can just hold down and do edit. And now there you can see it's right there. Now I can grab it and move it around, put it anywhere I want, over my eyeball, whatever. But I'm going to leave it there because I like it. I'm going to click done. And I'm ready to shoot. So basically in this sequence i maybe i wanted to show people the new mini 4 uh talk about my book for a second and then that's it and just get a quick facebook live out there with some great information so uh, next to that is i have the ability to do zoom so on the right side here i can zoom in and out right there actually we'll zoom out a little bit um, and then i can choose my focus is it manual oops is it manual focus automatic i can lock focus um, which is great because you don't want things to be pulsing back and forth. Exposure levels, I can do exposure stuff there. White balance, and I can use the LED light on the front of the camera if I want to. So it's got some really, really um, powerful things there. Um, and that's it. It's that simple. It's not a big training session. It's just simple. It's good to go. I'm going to press uh, the live button. And uh, we are live. I'm going to switch over to uh, Facebook now. And let's uh, zoom. Let me just refresh the page for a second. And you should see this momentarily. And 
let's go down It'll probably take another second and there we are live that's the signal there I can click on it now I can go and see if there's any uh, if you have a, if you want to do this at home you can at least see uh, what people are commenting and whatnot. So now I can pull this up and I can say, okay, there's my logo right there. And you should see the logo in a few seconds show up on the screen. There's a slight delay, of course, between going live and having it out on the uh, world there. But we've got the logo there. And then we're going to, um, there, I think the logo's gonna pop on right now. Yep, there it is. And now, um, let's say we're um, introducing, hey guys, I want to tell you about the iPad Mini 4. Here's a quick video. I'm pressing it. There's my video going. And you can see that. And uh, showing my video. Maybe you're at a convention, or you got some hot news you want to have. You can do all these things. Um, it's fantastic. And then we're going to go back to, hey, this is my new book and um, do some great stuff like that. And that is fantastic. To Facebook friends, I'm just doing a quick demo on um, Switcher Go, a video tutorial I'll post in a little while. So um, we're gonna stop Facebook Live. It's transferring to the server. We are good with that. And as soon as it's done transferring, we're gonna switch back over. We're gonna close the app out for one second. And now I'm going to go into switch or go one more time. Now we're going to go to YouTube and I'm going to check out, let me go on a YouTube channel, youtube.com. It doesn't need to be difficult to do all these uh, amazing things, which I'm thrilled about. So let me pull up uh, my channel and there it is. And, um, we should be ready to go. So let me go in here. I'm going to delete this. We're going to call this um, Iographer TV. Iographer TV dash switcher go demo. Okay, so it almost got everything right. Everybody says Iographer phone. It's really funny. So let's delete the phone part, leave that alone. And we're just going to do, let's go here, demoing Switcher Go's ability to go live on YouTube. And I'm just going to fix this for a second and do a, sorry, one second. Where's my switcher goes ability? Okay, done. And I'm gonna do a create a 720 stream. I'm gonna create a YouTube stream. It's loading it. And I should see this in switcher, in, um, in YouTube, I should say. And let's go up into YouTube now. Once again, we'll do the same thing. So we're going to, I'm gonna bring this up, get my lower thirds in there. So we'll have that momentarily. And this was all in the, uh, inside of the uh, manager, your creator studio. And usually you can go on the right side here and find creator studio, uh, go into the video manager, etc. stream now. Um, this was all built in, um, so it's great. And then we're going to, um, so we got our lower thirds going. Slight delay, more of a delay on, um, on uh, YouTube. Now I'm gonna bring in some video once again. We'll close this, there's my video. So we can do something fun like this. And then I'll bring this back up. And then when this is over, we're gonna switch back over into um, the book. And thank you everybody. So here's my new book, um, Life Camera Action. It is on sale on Amazon. Thank you guys for watching. If you're on YouTube watching this video, I was doing a demo of Switcher Go and how to go live, and you can actually watch the tutorial on my YouTube channel. Um, so this is just a quick demo. And that's it. We are good to go there. I can go over here now and press the plus button. Maybe I want to add another photo of this whole thing. So I'll scroll way down. And um, let's see, I'll just bring this one up here. Sorry. 
and I'm going to use the, so see how it says use as image or use as overlay. So I can do both. Let me just put it as an overlay. So there it is. I'm going to put it on this side. I can make it bigger or not. And we're going to have that as an overlay. So see, I have two overlays now, right and left. You can make your own lower thirds there and bring that in. And there you can see that I have um, both overlays going. Simple, simple to use and um, highly recommend checking it out. Switcher Go. I love Switcher Go, you guys. It is such an easy way to go live. Thanks for watching. I'm Dave Basulto. Check us out at iographer.com. Cheers.